Uh, so as you can see, <clears throat> since I um, put this light up above it, it's a light I can't control. It's just like a shop light, $30 shop light. But uh, that's why I took all the cleanest ones and put them upstairs. This is not going to be easy to get these fish out of here. Not at all. I turned their, their filter off. Uh, like two days ago. Um, which, yeah, it didn't help with these. I guess, I think it's dinos, dinoflagellates, or cyanobacter. It's probably cyano. I don't know. But I can't wait to get the fish back upstairs for one. But uh, <clears throat> this is actually in the way. Uh, so I need to move them out. So I can use this space for the new one. Which actually, I was going to actually do a saltwater one down here. But I decided... Gonna be fresh water because it's gonna be a terrible, it's gonna be a terrible tank, but it's gonna be really cool. Cause I can do a lot more with a turtle tank than I can, or a turtle pond than I can do with a <clears throat> saltwater pond. Even though it's really cool and they like it, but uh, the whole reason I have these saltwater fish and don't do like the corals is because of the beauty of the fish and I, I mean you could you know you can see them in here but like hmm not like an aquarium and obviously the puffer was out right before I pulled out my phone <laughs> But uh, yeah, this ain't gonna be. This ain't gonna be easy to catch fish in here. <laughs> Tell you that much. So I got the everything like the parameters are the exact same as it is in here with the new water, but like it still stresses me out moving saltwater fish. I have no problem moving freshwater fish at all. I it stresses me out moving saltwater fish. And uh, the like the little bit of rocks that are up there only at first. I just want to see all all my fish swimming around <laughs> at first, and then I'm gonna move all these rocks. But I want to clean them all off. That's why, like, I took all the cleanest ones and put them up there to get you know like the bio filter started. And <clears throat> I uh, I had these ones cleaned off. I'm not gonna put that real big one in. I don't know exactly how I want to set it up yet, if I want to slope it from the front to the back, or if I just want to have it like little towers, separate towers, like little islands, or like, I don't know how I'm going to do it yet. Sure, they're not going to be um, 
happy at first. All right, I'll show you them when I. I'll show you when I'm moving them into the new aquarium. Actually, if I can pause it. If it stops, it stops. I'll try to pause it and see if I can make it all one video. <laughs> Strategy ain't working. Mike, any of you guys want to come over and see what I'm doing? Look, I'm stirring up the bottom. <laughs> so I don't do like. You want to come over? Hmm? <laughs> so I open the um, butterfly fish. She always comes over and checks me out. Like, oh, there's the puffer. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to take all the rocks out and drain it. I was hoping I could just catch one fish <laughs> and put it upstairs you know, like it's a tester. And just monitor it and if it starts looking bad, you know, like sink it back. And, oh, the, the butterfly fish is kind of dead because he's, he just he can't, he can't resist but coming over. Either him or the trigger. Can I see what's in the net here? Um, can I see in the net? <laughs> You're like, nope. <laughs> and the puffer. Maybe when they come around the rock, I can just surprise them. But <laughs> it'll never work. <laughs> I'd have better chances catching them with my with my hands. Actually, let me try that. Oh, got a little piece of coral. All right. Oh, goodness. Got one swim. Look, I got food. I don't, but they don't know that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to have to do it the hard way. I was hoping to just, before I like, flip it down, put one in as a tester. Oh, come here, Joker. Come here, buddy. Come here. I don't have food, but you want some anyway. Come here. Come here. Come here. This can work. Come on. Oh, look, we go fingers. We go fingers. Come on. Top side, not the bottom. Come on. Joker would be a good one because he's very hardy. He's like, yep, nope. <laughs> Mm. 
Bij de 5 is 10. Ja, ja. Ja, ja. Ja, ja. Ja, ja. Competition. Who will get here first? Come on. <laughs> All right. I'll uh, show you guys after I drain the drain it and catch them. I have to do it the hard way. All right. I tried to uh, tried it the easy way. Didn't work. <laughs> like there was ever a chance of that. <laughs> You never know, though. So my, my fish are very friendly. But, uh, yeah, no, it was never going to happen. All right, everyone. Have a good one. I'll be loading up today with videos. So. And uh, I'll be explaining things, too, about, like, don't just do what I do and move fish around all the time. You have to... I'll explain, like, tips on how to do it, but uh, to keep the fish alive while you do it. So. All right. Uh, have a good one.